There were five people who attacked him unexpectedly, one escaped, one died on the spot, and the other three were half dead. Most of the bodies of the three sneak attackers were cut to pieces, but they were god kings, and their physical injuries would not kill them. Just give them a little time to recover. If the legion ruler hadn't controlled him just now, he might have escaped now. Looking at the three remnants of the legion rulers, with the yellowed bodies and yellow blood similar to the color of the desert, Lin Moyu already knew their race. Sand Clan. It's not a strong clan in the big world, but it's not too weak either. They live in a corner of the big world, and there is no major conflict with the human race, but they are not friendly either. There is not much information about the Sand Clan in the human race. Lin Moyu only knows that the Sand Clan is good at the laws of kings and stones. It is said that they were born from the desert, and the family is also full of sand and rocks, so their appearance here will not make people feel, 583, surprises. It's just that Lin Moyu didn't expect that this race would attack him unexpectedly. I really don't know what they think. Are the Terrans something they can afford? If it is not done well, it is hard to say that it will bring about the disaster of extermination. Lin Moyu looked at him, and the half-dead Sand Clan also looked at Lin Moyu. You don't need to ask, we won't say anything. A member of the Shah tribe suddenly said. His voice is also very hoarse, like countless gravels rubbing against each other, which is not pleasant to hear. Lin Moyu smiled slightly, you are so stupid, how did you become a god king? Just one sentence told Lin Moyu that there was a reason for attacking him. With this kind of IQ, Lin Moyu thinks they can be compared with the bull demons. As for the reason, there is no need to ask at all. With a thought, the ruler of the legion raised his sword and directly beheaded the three Shah people. With a flick of the finger, undead flames flew out and enveloped them. Even the Sand Clan who was directly beheaded just now was not spared. Physical rebirth, soul reorganization. Soon Lin Moyu had four Sand Clan resurgents crawling in front of him. Tell me why you attacked me. Lin Moyu's words are the highest order, unless it touches the prohibition in the soul, otherwise he knows everything. The four Sha people spoke at the same time, and their voices were intertwined, which was very chaotic. Lin Moyu immediately stopped and chose one of them, you say it. The person from the Sand tribe immediately told what he knew, about a million kilometers ahead, they found a leader-level monster. The people of the Shah tribe were going to hunt and kill this leader-level monster, but they were afraid that someone would come and disturb it and affect the hunting, so they sent troops to guard nearby. Lin Moyu asked, to be more specific, how many people are there in your Sand clan? How many of them went to hunt leader-level monsters, and how many of them stayed outside? The people of the Shah people are like countless treasures, in the area covered by the number. One fireball, there are a thousand of us Shah people. 500 of them are going to hunt leader-level monsters, and the other 500 are in groups of five, guarding each area. There are still many people. The Shah clan is not a strong clan, and it is not easy to mobilize a thousand god kings at once. But to use 500 god kings to hunt and kill a leader-level monster, it shows that this monster is very strong. Moreover, the Shah people are afraid of being disturbed by others, which shows that their strength cannot crush the leader-level monsters. Lin Moyu believes that among the god kings of the Sand Clan, there must be god kings of the 6th and 7th ranks. 500 gods and kings could not crush the monsters together, and they were afraid that people would come and disturb them and affect the hunting. Similarly, in the case of being unable to crush, it is necessary to hunt monsters, which shows that the benefits that can be obtained are very important. Lin Moyu analyzed it instinctively, and suddenly realized that he was a bit stupid. The best answer is right in front of you, just ask, why think about it yourself? Lin Moyu asked, among the god kings of your sand clan, what realm is the strongest? The three sand people were silent, Lin Moyu did not allow them to speak. The selected sand man confessed honestly, in the number one fireball area, the strongest of our sand people is the sixth level god king. But this time, in order to hunt down leader level monsters, the sand clan has brought a few strong seventh level god kings, and they will lead the team. The distribution of our tasks this time was also formulated by them. The human race has not set foot in the lowest desert for thousands of years, and many information is outdated. This place has been occupied by foreign races, and many of the information in the materials are no longer compatible and need to be updated. Incorrect information sometimes causes unnecessary trouble. The fireballs in the sky were numbered by various ethnic groups in the lowest desert, and a consensus was formed. The outermost ones are fireballs 1 to 4. 
Afterwards, fireballs number 5 to number 7 belong to the middle level area. The radiation ranges of number 8 and number 9 fireballs belong to the deep region. Different areas have different difficulties and different degrees of danger. The outer area corresponds to the monsters below the sixth level of the King of Gods. The middle area corresponds to the seventh and eighth ranks of God King. The deep area is above the ninth level of the King of Gods. As for the place passing through the deep area, the few sand people in front of them are not clear, they have never been there. According to them, even if it is the ninth level of God King, it is not easy to enter the deep level. The deep area is full of dangers and dangers. Just the fireball in the sky is enough to block the way of the ninth rank of the God King. As for why the leader level monsters are hunted, it is because only the leader level monsters will drop the key to the next layer of area. If you want to go to the middle area, you must hunt and kill leader level monsters in the outer area. Every leader level monster will drop a number of keys, and only with the keys can you freely enter and exit the outer and middle layers. After Lin Mo Yu asked, I finally got enough information. Lin Mo Yu finally has enough understanding of the lowest desert. The information given by the human race has also been updated, some of which are still useful, and some have been invalidated. No wonder, if you practice here, as long as you improve your cultivation, you will sooner or later go to a deeper area. Leader level monsters are not easy to encounter. If you are unlucky, you may not encounter them once in decades. I came across it by chance, so naturally I have to hunt and kill it with all my strength. The four outer areas radiated by fireballs 1 to 4 have been occupied by humans. The sand tribe occupies area 1, the stone demon family of the demon family occupies area 2, the earth monster family occupies area 3, and area 4 is divided up by various races. Area 5 in the middle layer is jointly occupied by the sand clan and the earth monster clan. The demons are very strong and completely occupy area 6. The situation in Area 7 is also chaotic, and there are two tribes. As for the deep areas number 8 and number 9, it is temporarily unknown. Lin Mo Yu organized his thoughts and cleared his mind. From this, he discovered a problem, that is, the frequency of leader level monsters appearing. According to the population of the Sand Clan, leader level monsters appear randomly, sometimes for several years, sometimes for decades. But Lin Mo Yu thinks otherwise. There must be a law for the appearance of leader level monsters, but the Sha people did not discover this law. In other words, these few Sha people don't know. And it is very possible that the need to pass through the deep layer is also related to the leader level monster. There is a chance to figure out this rule. Lin Mo Yu thought in his heart, and suddenly looked into the distance. A powerful aura rose from hundreds of thousands of kilometers away. This breath has almost reached the peak of the seventh ordered true god. The realm is not very high, but the aura is majestic, like a king looking down on the world, standing proudly between the heaven and the earth. Under the impact of this breath, all realms will be suppressed abruptly, making it difficult to display their original strength. Hundreds of thousands of kilometers apart, Lin Mo Yu could see thousands of yellow bands of light in the sky, flying towards the distance and blending into them. This is a leader-level monster. The leader level monster was born, and the momentum was incomparably huge, spreading at least a million kilometers. The Shah tribe obviously knew this, so they sent people out to defend within a million kilometer zone. But Lin Mo Yu thinks it's useless, there will always be other races coming. Especially the demon clan, they will definitely want to get the key to enter the Chinese region. Even if you can't get it yourself, you don't want to be got by the Shah people. According to the information just obtained, in the middle area, there is also competition among various ethnic groups. If you have too many people going in, it means that I am weakened. What's more, in addition to dropping keys, boss level monsters will also drop some excellent materials. These materials are also the ultimate treasures for comprehending the laws. Few of the people who came to the lowest desert came for the purpose of comprehending the law. Otherwise, what are you doing here at the risk of risking it? Wouldn't it be nice to retreat and practice at home safely? A phantom appeared in the distant sky, outlining the outline of a monster. This is a huge scorpion. It is quite normal to see scorpions in the desert, but this is the first time I have seen such a big scorpion. From the appearance it outlines, the length from the beginning to the end is at least thousands of kilometers. Just the high raised tail is more than a thousand kilometers long. Compared with many huge starry sky behemoths, it is not much less. 
It gradually took shape in the air, with a total of four pairs of scorpion legs, each insect is like a blade, and the sawtooth on it is clearly visible. Then dense barbs appeared on the body, which made the scalp tingle. Finally, there is the thousands kilometer long tail. The tip of the tail is a slender needle, which is extremely sharp at first glance. It's very powerful. Lin Mo Yu saw in his eyes that this leader level monster has definitely reached the peak of the 7th level god king, and it is not much worse than some 8th level god kings. Moreover, it exudes a thick and majestic aura, and under the aura, it suppresses the strength of others. Coupled with its huge size, its vitality is extremely terrifying. It's no wonder that even the Shah clan, with 500 God King powers, is not sure about crushing it. Even if the 8th rank of God King came, he wouldn't dare to crush it. Lin Mo Yu looked at the scorpion gradually taking shape in the void, and felt a little strange, why don't you let the powerhouses of the 8th or 9th rank of the God King take action? The resurrected Sand clan answered truthfully, most of the powerhouses of the 8th or 9th rank of the God King have entered the middle or deep layer. Even the seventh rank of the god king rarely moves in the outer layer. And after they get the key and enter the middle or deep area, although they can return, they cannot attack the boss monsters in the outer area. Once they make a move, the leader level monsters will not drop keys, nor will they drop materials. Also, even those who have not obtained the power above the key god Wang Ji, will lose a lot. Lin Mo Yu frowned, this setting sounds very familiar. Isn't it just killing monsters by leapfrogging, which will reduce the drop rate? This was not the case in the copy of the small world before. If the level of the monster exceeds too much, the monster will not drop things anymore. It's just that it's more strict here, if it exceeds the first level, it will affect the drop rate, and if it exceeds the second level, basically nothing will drop. Therefore, the ones who can make the most shots are only the seventh level god kings, who are on par with monsters. There is such a restriction, Lin Mo Yu thought of another question, besides the realm restriction, there are other restrictions, please explain clearly. The Sand Clan Risen said a few more restrictions. In addition to level restrictions, there are also restrictions on the number of people. It cannot exceed 500 people. Once there are more than 500 people, the strength of the leader level monster will increase accordingly, and it will be more difficult to fight. And there is also a time limit, they only have one hour, if the leader level monster cannot be killed within an hour, the leader level monster will disappear, and it is unknown when it will reappear next time. It is precisely these two reasons that the Sand Clan is afraid of others making trouble. The scorpion in the void became more and more clear, the outline of the body was fully formed, and a big mouth appeared in sight, with a row of densely packed teeth on it. In ten more minutes at the most, it will be fully formed. At this time, Lin Mo Yu had already felt the aura of many god kings, and the Sand Clan god kings were ready to go. Lin Mo Yu didn't waste any more time and rushed over quickly. The four Sha people continued to stay here and did not go with him. A member of the Sha tribe escaped before, so if these people go back, they will inevitably arouse suspicion. At the same time, Lin Mo Yu knew that his appearance must have been known by the people of the Sha people, and there would be people of the Sha people waiting for him in all likelihood. Originally, Lin Mo Yu didn't care about the leader level monsters in the lowest desert. It should be said that he didn't care about all the monsters in the lowest desert, because he didn't need the crystal nuclei that fell out of the monsters. But it's different now, he needs the key dropped by the leader level monster, otherwise he can't enter the next layer of area. Although he is confident, he is not to the point of arrogance. Against the rules in the lowest desert, he doesn't have this weight. The lowest desert comes from chaotic rules. Although so far, there is no evidence that the lowest desert is related to ancient times, even if it is not a product of ancient times, it is also a product of recent times. The power contained in it, even Zhu Kiwu can't do anything about it. A small shrimp like him is nothing. Now he has to act according to the rules, kill the boss level monster, get the key. Then he figured out that leader level monsters 997 appeared regularly, and he couldn't afford to wait here for several years or even decades, and he couldn't afford to waste this time. Lin Mo Yu tried his best to restrain his breath, put away the legion ruler, and approached silently. At the same time, he took back the death knights who had already dispersed, and then released a large number of death knights to help the sand tribe protect them, quickly forming a new line of defense. He also didn't want others to disturb him, at least he didn't want anyone to disturb him until he killed the big scorpion. This big scorpion is not easy to deal with, especially since it cannot use power beyond its own realm, so Lin Mo Yu has to take it seriously. The Death Knights deployed the defenses silently. 
they had no life breath, and they would not disturb the monsters in the lowest desert. As long as they avoid the eyes and ears of the Sand Clan, there will be no problems. Moreover, the soul of the Sand Clan is so clear in the eyes of the undead, the whole process is not difficult for Lin Moyu. Lin Moyu stopped a thousand kilometers away from the Scorpion. This distance was close enough for him, and he could reach it almost instantly. Before doing anything, he wanted to see how the Sand Clan fought. If you know yourself and know your enemy, you can fight with ease. Accompanied by a sharp cry, the scorpion finally took shape, and a large piece of yellow sand rose into the sky, wrapping the scorpion in the air, forming a layer of yellow sand. Following the rules in the lowest desert, the scorpion fell from the sky and hit the yellow sand heavily. The yellow sand once again covered the sky and the sun, blocking even the heat of the fireball in the air. For a while, the yellow sand was like a thick fog, and it was difficult to see anything, and the scorpion in the yellow sand also lost its figure. Durit. Before recovering his sight, he suddenly shouted loudly, and the Sha people who had been ambushing for a long time moved. In the lead were five members of the Sha tribe, with the seventh level cultivation base of the god king, holding a golden machete in their hands, and rushed to the holy god first. The sand people rush into the yellow sand, others can't see clearly in this situation, but they won't. The sand people were born in the desert, and they live with the sand all their lives, and the yellow sand is their best eyes. The bright knife light tore through the yellow sand in the sky, and the silhouette of the scorpion was reflected in the knife light. The knife light fell on the scorpion's body, feet, tail and head. Each of the five fierce attacks had its own meaning, and all of them were full strength blows ready to go. Lin Moyu has already switched to the vision of the undead, and he can see clearly. The knife light sliced through the scorpion's armor, broke some of the scorpion's fur, and caused several hundred meter long skin wounds. With the body shape of a scorpion thousands of kilometers long, the wound is only a hundred meters in size, which is indeed just a skin trauma. Even the skin has just been broken a little bit, and even the carapace has not been completely cut. But the five attacks also made the scorpion angry, it quickly locked on to the five people and launched a fierce counterattack. The tail turned into an afterimage, and stabbed violently at a god king of the Sand Clan. A shield appeared in the hands of the Sand God King, and a heavy armor box appeared on his body at the same time. The shield is huge, with complex patterns engraved on it, emitting orange light. The light turned into a 100 meter high wall, connecting the sky and the earth, and firmly protecting him behind him. He was already prepared for the scorpion's attack. The scorpion's tail pierced the high wall and exploded like high bubbles. The god king of the Sand Clan snorted and was blown away by the huge force. But he was not injured, and even the shield in his hand was not damaged. At this time, the scorpion's tail attacked again, and the target turned to another Sand Clan god king. This Sand God King is also wearing armor and holding a shield, exactly the same as the previous one. The shield transformed into a high wall, blocking the scorpion's attack. He was also sent flying, but he was not injured at all. Then the other three also enjoyed the same treatment. Their defense method is exactly the same. The scorpion's round of attack is fast and swift, less than half a second before and after. After the last sand god king was blown away, the first four had already flown back. The four of them happened to be standing at the four corners of the scorpion, vaguely seeming to surround the scorpion. He held the shield high in his hand, and the shield once again burst into orange light, stronger than before. The rays of light from the four shields connected the sky and the earth, connected together, formed a circle of light, and built a wall of light to completely surround the scorpion. The scorpion began to attack the light wall, but this time the light wall was not broken and became extremely strong. At this time, the god king of the sand clan who was finally shaken flew back, and he flew to the top of the scorpion, and the shield in his hand also glowed with orange light, connecting with the surrounding light walls as a whole. All around, a light wall appeared above the head, blocking the scorpion. Then the god king of the sand clan stomped their feet at the same time, the sand was blown up, and a wall of light appeared under the sand field. The light wall is like a boxy cube, enveloping the scorpion inside. The five sand god kings continued to supply power to the shield in their hands, maintaining the light wall, allowing the scorpions to attack inside, and the light wall remained motionless. At least until their strength is exhausted, the scorpion can't get out. However, this place is full of powerful earth and rock laws, and for the sand people, it is the real home field, and their consumption can be quickly replenished. Trapped in the light wall, the scorpion became more violent. 
The tail, the scorpion legs, kept attacking Lin Zhuguang's wall, and let out one ugly scream after another. After waiting for about ten seconds, one of the sand god kings roared again, Dear it tilde. The second sound of hands, not for them. As his voice fell, a large number of figures appeared under the sand. A large number of sand kings rushed out and began to attack the scorpions. The scorpion couldn't break through the wall of light, but the attacks of the sand clan kings could penetrate the wall of light and land on the scorpion. Although the cultivation of these sand people is only between the fourth and sixth ranks of god kings, the damage to the scorpion is minimal. But it really can't stand the crowd, as long as the attacks are enough and long enough, they can also cause some damage. Lin Moyu saw what the Sha people did, and silently commented, surround and annihilate them, trap them and destroy them. Although the scraping tactics are not efficient, they are better than safety. He thought of his instance in the small world, many times he used the scraping tactics to fight the boss. Each hit doesn't do much damage, but as long as it lasts long enough, the boss can be killed. It's like someone pricking another person with a needle. A prick may just sting, but it won't cause much harm. But tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, or even tens of millions of pricks. That person can also be stabbed to death alive. Of the 500 Sand Clan God Kings, only 400 actually took action, and another 100 people stood by and watched from a distance. They are not only reserve personnel, but also guard against harassment from other races. In addition, attacking scorpions cannot exceed 500 people. If there are more than 500 people, scorpions' combat power will increase. So the extra 100 quota is also a kind of redundancy. In this way, even if a small number of enemies attack the scorpion, increasing the number of attackers will not make the scorpion stronger. It was not the first time that the Sand Tribe had dealt with leader-level monsters, and they were obviously very experienced. I've thought about all the things that might happen. Lin Moyu watched it for a while, and made some calculations. According to their scraping method, the scorpion can be killed in about half an hour. Scorpion's strategy time is one hour, which is completely enough. But for half an hour, won't other races really come over to harass? If not, why would the Sha people spend so much trouble? Lin Moyu was not in a hurry, his goal was not to kill the scorpion, but to get the key to the next layer. Even if scorpion was killed by the Sha people, it would be enough for him to grab the key. After all, there is only one person, and all he needs is a key. Ten minutes later, the Death Knight finally sent back a message. Finally, a foreign team rushed over. Two teams came, one was a team of demons, with about a hundred people. The demons who are active here are stone demons from the Hell series. The whole body of the stone demon was covered by huge stones. When they were unable to fly, they huddled together and kept rolling forward in the desert at a very fast speed. The yellow sand sticks to the body, and the stone is like a yellow ball. The other team is also around a hundred people and belongs to the Earth Monster family. The appearance of the earth monster is a bit close to that of the tree ant, their whole body is made of mud, and they rush towards them flying yellow sand. The troops arranged by the sand clan along the way started to try to stop the stone demon, but it was useless. The stone demon ignored their attacks, and rolled over the yellow sand like a wheel, and rushed straight to where the scorpion was. However, the earth monsters were not blocked by the sand tribe, and the earth monsters did not rush towards the scorpion, but rushed in the direction of the stone demon. Dot. Soon, the teams of stone demons and earth monsters came into contact. The earth monsters spread out the field of law, and their laws are unified, and even the fields of law can be combined with each other, regardless of each other. The yellow sand with a radius of thousands of kilometers instantly turned into soft soil, like a swamp. The stone demon rolled into it and fell into the quagmire, unable to continue rolling forward, had to return to its standing appearance. The stone demons roared angrily, Earth monsters, you are looking for death. The god king of the Earth monster clan remained silent and did not answer. Lin Moyu found information about the Earth monsters from his memory. The Earth monster clan, like the Sand clan, is not considered a strong clan, and there are not many people in the clan, but there are still some strong people in the clan. Individual strength is not weaker than any race of the same level. They don't like to talk, and their personalities are relatively simple and honest. The Earth Monster had a good relationship with the human race for a period of time, but for some reason, it gradually became alienated from the human race. But no matter when, the Earth Monsters and the human race have never had an enmity, and the relationship between the two parties is generally passable. 
No matter how the stone demons clamored, the field monsters did not respond. And they didn't do anything, they just trapped the stone demon, making it difficult for the stone demon to get rid of it for a while. If it is in the starry sky, or in an area where it can fly, the earth monsters can't trap the stone demon. But in this special environment, the stone demons have nothing to do with the earth monsters. Lin Mo Yu guessed that San Clan should have promised something to the earth monsters to let them do this. Moreover, after entering the middle area, the earth monsters and the sand clan occupy an area together, and the relationship between the two should not be bad. He watched it for a while and stopped paying attention, knowing that it would be difficult for the stone demon to break through the obstruction of the earth monster. At this time, a golden light came from a distance. The golden light was extremely fast, encircling the emperor's yellow sand. Through the vision of the undead, Lin Mo Yu saw the person coming, who was a god king of the golden eagle clan. It seemed useless for the Golden Eagles to come here, but Lin Mo Yu knew why in the next second. This god king of the Golden Eagle clan, in addition to the unique speed laws of the Golden Eagle clan itself, also exudes the laws of the Earth system. This is a god king with two laws. Double laws are not uncommon, and there are some god kings in the human race who master multiple laws at the same time. Even Lin Mo Yu, in addition to his own law of immortality, also masters the law of killing, and even the law of thunder and lightning. It's just that he obeyed Zhu Jian's words and temporarily gave up these two laws. The king of the Golden Eagle clan broke through the defensive circle of the Sand clan at an astonishing speed. The speed was so fast that the god king of the Sand clan didn't even react. Lin Mo Yu didn't let the Death Knight do anything, the Golden Eagle clan's god king realm had reached the eighth rank of god king, and the Death Knight couldn't stop him. The god king of the Golden Eagle clan came not far from the scorpion in an instant, standing in the yellow sand flying all over the sky, he said loudly, give me a key later, and I can promise not to do it. The faces of the god kings of the sand tribe were not good looking, and there was a little anger in their eyes, but they did not speak. They have leaders, and it is not their turn to speak. The god king of the sand clan who gave orders, after looking at the god king of the Golden Eagle clan for a few seconds, said in a deep voice, yes, but I also have one condition. The god king of the Golden Eagle clan said in a deep voice, say it. The leader of the Shah tribe said, if there are other 8th level gods coming, you have to block them. The king of the Golden Eagle tribe thought for a few seconds, and replied, I will do my best. Good. Here's a deal. If he did, the Sand clan would basically be unable to stop him. Once the 8th level god king strikes, according to the rules in, Lowest Desert, the scorpion is the 7th level god king. Once a strong man of the 8th level god king strikes, the key materials dropped will be greatly reduced. If there is a 9th level action from the god king, the scorpion will not drop anything. Lin Mo Yu watched for a few more minutes, knowing that there would be no more accidents. He revealed his figure and galloped towards the battlefield. His appearance attracted the attention of many Sha people. On Lin Mo Yu's body, the aura of true gods is very obvious. True gods come here. I'm afraid they will be eaten by sandworms as soon as they enter the desert. How could it be possible to get here safely? The appearance of Lin Mo Yu is a little weird. Moreover, human races rarely appear here, and they have never seen human races for so many years. At this moment, a leader of the sand tribe suddenly looked at Lin Mo Yu with a fierce look in his eyes. Human race, you are the one who killed my Sha people. The Sha people who wanted the Legion ruler to flee before brought their own information back. But he didn't tell the other Shah people, but told their leader. Smiling, trying to sneak up on me, I'm just myself. This is a matter of course, and even some righteous words. The leader of the Shah clan snorted coldly, they didn't do anything. Lin Mo Yu said indifferently, peeping is equivalent to doing something. I believe that the first action is the first, is there a problem? The leader of the Shah clan said in a deep voice, whether this matter is right or wrong, what you want to do when you come here now? Lin Mo Yu said, I want a key. The people of the Sha tribe laughed out of anger, and the leader of the Sha tribe's voice was cold, like sand rubbing against each other, you are dreaming. Lin Mo Yu smiled slightly, I'll just ask you to give it or not. At this moment, the people of the sand tribe couldn't get away, and the leader of the sand tribe got some information about Lin Mo Yu from the subordinates who had fled back. Lin Mo Yu seems to have several very powerful puppets, which can easily kill the yellow sand giant in seconds. Although they have hundreds of Sha people as backup, if they fight Lin Mo Yu, they may be killed or injured. The leader of the Sha clan turned his eyes and said to the king of the Golden Eagle clan, according to our agreement, I trouble you to kill him. 
The King of the Golden Eagle Clan laughed. Our Golden Eagle Clan and the Human Clan are mortal enemies. Even if there is no agreement, this king will not let him go. It's just that this king is very curious. How did a little guy in the real god realm get here? As far as this king knows, the human race has abandoned this area, and the human race has never set foot here for thousands of years. Lin Mo Yu looked at the Golden Eagle God King and sighed softly, you talk too much. As he said that, a group of flames appeared beside him, and the flames instantly turned into a fire. Della Spell, summon the Elemental Lich. The flaming galaxy Lich looked at the King of the Golden Eagle Clan, his eyes flashed with fiery red light. The bodies of the golden eagles instantly became hot, as if they were being burned by flames. It's not purely high temperature, but the calendar area with flames. At this moment, the flaming galaxy lich disappeared instantly. The soul of the god king of the golden eagle clan jumped wildly. He felt the danger and wanted to escape immediately. At this moment, a galaxy of laws appeared in the sky above him. The Law Galaxy is burning with raging flames, God Lord Golden Eagle makes a strange cry and goes to the Law Galaxy. The voice was inconceivable and terrifying. What kind of method is it to summon Law Galaxy to attack, how can there be such a terrifying method? Even a god can't do it. The Law of Fire Galaxy is so huge that it swallows it the moment it appears. The Golden Eagle God King's whole body is shining with golden light, struggling crazily in the Galaxy of Laws. The law of speed that the golden eagles are proud of has no effect at this moment. It unfolds the field of soul law, and the soul manipulates the magic weapon to attack the law galaxy, bursting the golden feathers all over the body, fighting to the death. But all attacks are futile, the flames devoured all its attacks, and at the same time devoured its body and soul. The king of the golden eagle clan, who was majestic just a moment ago, disappeared at this moment. The Flame Law Galaxy disappeared, and the Flame Galaxy Lich returned to Lin Moyu's side, standing quietly like this. But this scene made all the Sha people terrified. The God King of the Golden Eagle Clan died just like that. Isn't the Golden Eagle Clan known as the race with the best life-saving ability in the big world, so they died so easily? What kind of magic technique did this human race use to completely restrain the life-saving ability of the Golden Eagle tribe? It feels that even in the big world, without all kinds of restrictions, the Golden Eagles will not have the slightest chance. The leader of the Shah tribe's heart was beating wildly, fortunately he didn't let his tribe do anything before. Otherwise, I am afraid that I will die now. This human race looks like a true god, but in fact it must be more than just a true god. He must have used some means to disguise his realm. If the true god of the human race can be so strong, other races don't have to mix. Lin Moyu's soft voice came again, can I have a key now? The intermediary, the leader of the Sand Clan, hesitated for half a second, then whispered, yes. Does he dare to say no? If he says no, will everyone here die, including himself? Lin Moyu chuckled, those who know current affairs are brilliant, and your decision saved them. These words were whispered like a devil, making everyone's hearts chill. No one will doubt Lin Moyu's words, they all know that Lin Moyu does have this ability. Using a key to exchange the lives of all the clansmen here is a very profitable deal. As for the few people killed by Lin Moyu before, they can only be regarded as dead in vain. At least among the people here, no one dared to seek revenge from Lin Moyu. The ensuing battle went smoothly. As a leader-level monster, Scorpion finally died of scraping after persisting for nearly 40 minutes. I don't know how many attacks I have endured on my body, and no part of my body is intact. It's like a world-class boss appeared in a small world and was besieged by countless professionals, the situation is exactly the same. The moment the scorpion was in shape, it exploded, turning into yellow sand all over the sky. A pile of shimmering objects fell from the yellow sand. Lin Mo Yu counted about five or six pieces of materials, and all of them had two handfuls of fields. The leader of the Sha clan went up to put everything away, and then threw one of the keys to Lin Mo Yu. Lin Mo Yu took the key, and activated it with a slight movement of his soul power. The key turned into a stream of light and disappeared into his body. Lin Mo Yu found that there was an inexplicable aura in his body, which resonated with the Huangshan Desert. It seems that some of the rules were changed, just for him individually. He understood and knew that he had the qualifications to enter the next level. Not in a hurry to go in, Lin Mo Yu nodded slightly to the leader of the Sha tribe, thank you. In fact, for the Sha people, they have nothing to lose. Even if this key is not given to Lin Moyu, it must be given to the God King of the Golden Eagle Clan. 
Moreover, Lin Moyu kept his promise and did not make any additional demands. Seeing that Lin Moyu was about to leave, the Sha people, who were always on tenterhooks, were also relieved. Lin Moyu's footsteps just stopped suddenly, and he turned his head to look, which made him nervous again. They were afraid that after Lin Moyu repented and left, the Sha people here would not know how many escaped. Lin Moyu's voice was flat, there is a question, what conditions must be fulfilled for a leader-level monster to appear? Lin Moyu ruled out the possibility of waiting for a long time ago. He knew that there must be some kind of triggering condition for the appearance of leader-level monsters. If you give him some time, he can also find the corresponding trigger conditions. But he was too lazy to look for it, so it was more convenient to ask someone directly. Hearing Lin Moyu's question, the leader of the Sand Clan breathed a sigh of relief again, on the outer layer, just kill enough monsters. Then he added, sandworms don't count. Lin Moyu understood what he meant, that is to kill the monsters in the outer area, and after killing a certain number, the leader level monsters would naturally appear. Sandworms do not belong to the outer layer. They are monsters in the edge area, so they don't count. No wonder he didn't touch a single monster after entering the outer layer. There is no monster for hundreds of thousands of kilometers, which is very strange. It seems that all the monsters here have been wiped out by them. Knowing the answer, Lin Moyu asked again, the boss level monsters in the middle area use the same method. The leader of the Sha clan shook his head, each floor has different conditions, and the middle level area must be different from ours, but I don't know what the conditions are. Whether he lied to himself or not, Lin Moyu didn't want to pursue it. If he dared to lie to himself, he would come back from the middle level and slaughter the Sha clan here. Although he is not bloodthirsty, he is not a good man or a believer. From the beginning of the job change, he was fighting and killing all the way up. Lin Moyu continued to ask, the last question, how do you determine which area the leader level monster will appear in? Asking for flowers. There are four areas in the outer layer. If this condition is followed, it is possible to appear in any area. The leader of the Sand Clan said, the leader level monsters will appear anywhere on the outer layer. The specific location will only be known when the conditions are fulfilled, and only the person who killed the last monster will know. Fortunately, this the second time was when we Sha people killed the last monster. Lin Moyu hummed, thank you for your answer, I have no problem. As he spoke, he finally lifted his legs and left, and disappeared into the yellow sand in the blink of an eye. The wind blows, bringing yellow sand. A layer of fine sand-like substance emerged from behind all the sand people present. Although Lin Moyu didn't say anything, let alone exude any huge coercion, the pressure on him was really too great. The main reason is that Lin Moyu's method of killing the God King of the Golden Eagle race is too amazing, and the 8th level God King didn't kill him easily. Why did such a terrifying guy appear in the human race? The human race deserves to be one of the most powerful races in the world, it's too scary. Just now he used the law of fire, how can he summon the law of the galaxy, even the gods can't do it. Fortunately, we didn't provoke him, otherwise we would be the ones who died. Each and every one of the Sha people felt rejoicing, feeling like they had narrowly escaped death. In the big world, how can there be any benevolence, righteousness and kindness? You don't even need to make a move at a disagreement, and there are many people who meet and do it directly. If Lin Moyu made a move towards them, few of the more than 500 people here could survive. Everyone thinks that Lin Moyu is hiding his cultivation, Lin Moyu is at least a ninth level god king, or even a minor god. The earth monster received the news that the leader level monster had been eliminated. Their task is completed, according to the agreement, they can go to the sand tribe to get the part they deserve. They began to converge on the law field, preparing to retreat. At this time, the stone demon has no heart to fight anymore, and the leader level monsters have been killed. If they go there, it will be just a battle between the two clans, and there will be no benefit. But harsh words still have to be let go. Earth monsters, get ready for the revenge of our clan. The earth monsters are still silent. In fact, they haven't spoken since they appeared. Just as they were about to leave, they suddenly saw a figure approaching not far away. While the yellow sand was flying, a figure stepped on the wind and sand and walked from the hill not far away. He seemed to be slow but really fast, and he covered tens of thousands of kilometers in a few seconds, and by the time it was clear, he had arrived not far away. Lin Moyu stood beside the law field of the earth monster, looking at the stone monster with cold eyes. 
Now that he met the stone demon, Lin Moyu had no reason to let them go, as two races with blood feuds. Seeing Lin Moyu approaching, all the field monsters were stunned. Their eyes are small, but they can clearly feel the emotion of astonishment. Some of them don't understand what a human race in the real god realm is here to do. The stone demons who were still trapped in the quagmire on the other side didn't understand how a mere human race in the realm of true gods came here. Although stone monsters and earth monsters belong to two different races, they all have one characteristic in common. That is, the response is not fast, and they prefer to deal with things in a simple way. 663. Just like now, the first reaction of the earth monster is to put away the law domain. Regardless of Lin Moyu's strength, they first jumped out of the dispute between the human race and the demon race. Lin Moyu casually glanced at the mob monster with contempt. In the past, the relationship between the earth monsters and the human race was good. Later, when the human race was in trouble, the earth monsters also did the same. They jumped out of the dispute and did not help the human race. It is true that they are not a strong race. Facing the coalition forces of more than 200 races, one more of them will not help. In fact, what the human race needed more at the time was an attitude, and the attitude of the earth monsters displeased the higher ups of the human race. Later, when Xiao Zhangshan was born, he killed the coalition forces of various ethnic groups and entered the ancestral land of the clan, because the human race returned to the living space. The rise of the human race, the earth monsters gave some help to the human race at that time. But there was no timely delivery of carbon before, and the icing on the cake later is not worth mentioning. Since then, the relationship between the human race and the earth monster race has become flat, neither good nor bad. Now the earth monsters are still like this, and they left Jingyu immediately. Can they be regarded as grass on the wall, but what they do is no different from grass on the wall, which makes people unhappy. Races like earth monsters may only make corresponding choices when their interests are endangered. Like here, they join forces with the Sand Clan to fight the Demon Clan. Otherwise, they were afraid that they would be driven away by the Demon Clan long ago, so how could they not be able to occupy the territory? The Stone Demon's choice was equally simple, they chose to kill Lin Moyu. There was a blood feud between the two clans, and with the Stone Demon's simple mind, there was no need to say a word of nonsense, let alone look for the reason. After all, the human race has not stepped into this place for thousands of years, and something must happen if someone suddenly comes in. If it is replaced by a smarter person, you must ask what happened. The Maya disappeared and turned into yellow sand again. The stone demons regained their freedom of movement, ready to attack with grinning grins. Suddenly, a group of bright red fireworks appeared in the sky. The fireworks radiated terrifying heat, hotter than the nine fireballs, and the temperature rose sharply. Almost in a breath, the temperature has reached the point where even the God King is uncomfortable. How could there be a tenth fireball? Where did the fireball come from? Why is it so hot? This fireball looks weird, it's so close to us. The stone demon's brain is not easy to use. When they saw the fireball, they didn't react for a while. They didn't even think about whether it was Lin Moyu's attack method. The fireball exploded in their eyes, turning into a bright and beautiful flame galaxy. The power of the law of fire is swallowed up in the galaxy. It's the law galaxy. It's strange, how the law galaxy appeared here. It's not impossible. I've heard that the law galaxy will sometimes manifest in the world, and when it manifests, it will drop treasures in the galaxy. Really? Doesn't that mean we're lucky? Amidst the discussions of the stone demons, the galaxy of flames descended, covering them in their subjects. The flames were blazing, and the law of flames spewed out continuously, devouring them almost instantly. A few seconds later, the law of fire galaxy disappeared and appeared beside Lin Moyu as a fireman. Pyro is holding a lot of storage items in his hands, which are all trophies. This is really arson and murder. Lin Moyu muttered softly, and looked at the earth monster. The earth monsters looked at Lin Moyu silently, with vigilance and fear in their eyes. They were able to trap the stone demon, but they had the advantage of the law, and it did not mean that their combat power was stronger than the stone demon. Lin Moyu can easily kill hundreds of stone demons, and it is not difficult to kill them. Lin Moyu glanced at them and said in a low voice, where is the stronghold of the demon clan? Point to the direction. Most of the earth monsters did not move, and one of the earth monsters raised its hand and pointed in a direction. Lin Moyu turned and left without saying anything. In fact, Lin Moyu doesn't like races like Earth Monsters very much. 
if he is given a reason, he will really violently kill people. Raising this question now is also to give a reason not to kill them. Although it is necessary to go to the deepest point to save people, Zhu Qingyang has been trapped for thousands of years, and it is not so short of time. Lin Mo Yu first cleaned up all the demons in the lowest desert. As long as he doesn't come across little gods and the like, Lin Mo Yu is invincible in the lowest desert. The Death Knight was one step ahead of Lin Mo Yu, and ran away. Lin Mo Yu released millions of Death Knights, the purpose is not to let go of any demon. The Ten Legion rulers gallop rapidly in the yellow sand, with a huge body of 10 meters, every step could splash a large amount of yellow sand. A huge saber was dragged behind him, dragging a long ravine in the sandy field. Originally, he could kill at will, and kill each one he saw. But in order not to miss any demon, he had to figure out the situation in Area 2 first. Area 2 is very large, and there are many monsters along the way. Because of the Death Knight's particularity, the monsters encountered along the way will not actively attack them, which makes Lin Moyu's detection behavior much easier. Each of the four fireballs in the outer layer covers an area of about the same size. Its shape is irregular, probably in the shape of a balloon with a narrow inside and a wide outside. The distance between the most distant ends is about 300 million kilometers. There will be a large number of monsters in the area, some of these monsters are buried deep in the ground, and some of them will move on the surface of the yellow sand. Although Area 2 is under the control of the Demon Clan, due to the number of people, only about one third of the area is really controlled by the Demon Clan. There is still more than half of the range, which is the area where monsters live. Even if there is another race, there is no problem. But the demon race is too strong, and they just don't allow other races to approach, and those who approach him will be killed directly. Although the Sand Clan also occupies the number one area, at the edge of the area, they will still allow others to kill monsters and obtain crystal nuclei. The dominance of the demon clan can be seen. The Death Knights formed an encirclement circle, and the ruler of the Legion rushed there, commanding ten armies, and the encirclement circle began to shrink rapidly. The demon race has a stronghold in the center of this area. After hunting monsters outside and obtaining enough crystal nuclei, the demons will return to the stronghold and comprehend the law in the stronghold. There is no danger in this way. The stronghold is dominated by stone demons, and there are some other scattered demons. The total number is about a thousand. Counting the hundreds of people who were killed by Lin Mo Yu before, the number of demons deployed in the number two area is just over. Lin Mo Yu appeared 100,000 kilometers away from the Devil's Stronghold, with sharp eyes, it's time to close the net. In Lin Mo Yu's field of vision, ten Death Knight legions were ready to go and surrounded the Demon's Stronghold from all directions. The Death Knight legion was silent and did not cause any movement. Perhaps the Demon Clan felt that no one would dare to attack them, so they were not on guard from the outside world. The fact is true, even the Sand Clan and Earth Monsters dare not come here to launch a surprise attack on the Demon Clan. Even if the combined strength of both of them has surpassed the strength of the Demon Clan here. But so what? The Demon Clan is a strong clan. If they are ruthless, they can wipe out the two clans in the big world. This is even more so when it comes to the middle area. The two clans can only occupy one area together, while the Demon Clan can still monopolize one area. This is the strength of the race, there is nothing to do. But today, after a while, these demons will all die, and none of them will escape. I don't know how many of them are avatars, and how many of them are the main body. Lin Mo Yu whispered in his heart as he made the final arrangement. One by one, the skeleton gods will rush out, and millions of skeleton gods will cooperate with the Death Sixteen Knights to form a denser encirclement. If it is in the big world, this kind of encirclement has loopholes. The big world is three-dimensional and can break out from all directions. To encircle such a large area, the number of troops must be at least several times higher. Moreover, the combat power is not enough. The individual combat power of the Death Knights, with the blessing of the commanding technique, is only the first rank of the God King. The Skeleton God General is only the third rank of the God King. Facing the demons of the fourth to sixth ranks of the King of Gods, it is not enough to watch. What's more, it is even more impossible that there may still be strongmen of the seventh rank of God King in the Demon Stronghold. Therefore, neither the Death Knights nor the Skeleton Generals are the main force to kill these demons, they are more just to stop them. When the encirclement was formally formed, Lin Mo Yu had come to a place only a thousand kilometers away from the Demon Stronghold. 
No matter how much he restrained his breath, if he continued to approach, he would still be discovered. Of course, if he really wanted to keep getting closer, there was still a way. It's just unnecessary, this distance is enough. A starry elemental ch appeared beside Lin Moyu. The whole body of the element lich is radiant, and in the translucent body, there are thousands of stars intertwined to create dreamy colors. The starlight galaxy lich, the ninth level of the god king. But his real strength is not his combat power, but his technique. Fantasy starry sky, intertwined starry sky illusion, the maximum range of illusion is 1 million kilometer. Illusion has the effect of bewildering and confusing the enemy, up to the peak of the god king realm. With the dreamy starry sky and the encirclement, Lin Moyu is confident that these stone monsters will have nowhere to escape. Go. While muttering softly, the starlight galaxy lich disappeared, and the sky suddenly darkened in the next second. In the demon stronghold a thousand kilometers away, all the demons raised their heads together. They found that the fireball in the air was gone. In the sky that has never changed, a starry sky suddenly appeared. The starlight is bright and clear, layer upon layer sprinkled down, extremely beautiful. At this moment, the devil has the illusion of being in the big world. What happened? How come there is a starry sky here? Is the lowest desert going to disappear? Isn't it solidified here? Have the rules of chaos changed again? The demons exclaimed one after another, and some demons who were comprehending the law were also awakened. The stone demon's head was not working so well, and he couldn't figure out what happened for a while. Immediately afterwards, in the starry sky, a bright galaxy appeared. Law Galaxy. It's the law of the galaxy manifesting, there will be treasures falling. It's no wonder that the starry sky appeared. It turned out that the law of starlight manifested in the Milky Way. We are so lucky that we have encountered such a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. I don't know what treasures I can get. It is said that there are endless treasures in the galaxy of laws. If you can get one or two, you will get rich. No one has discovered that this law galaxy is hazy, and it does not have the power of law galaxy. Some are just the shape of the law galaxy, without the essence. Although it's just a projection, it's no problem to fool these stone demons who are not very good at brains. Just as the demons were immersed in joy, the projection of the galaxy of laws suddenly reversed, and the laws in the galaxy poured down, covering a radius of 10,000 kilometers. The 10,000 kilometers here is a spherical area with a diameter of 10,000 kilometers. Up, down, left, and right, even the ground is covered by dreamy starry sky magic. The yellow sand can't stop the illusory spells, even if the devil wants to escape from the ground, it's impossible. In the eyes of the demons, all kinds of treasures poured down from the galaxy of laws. There are astonishingly many treasures with astonishingly high grades. The demons seemed to be crazy, and kept picking up the dropped treasures. They forgot that they couldn't fly, so they kept jumping high, and there was even a robbery among the demons. This is mine. Let go, if you dare to steal my things, I will kill you. You don't want to die, you dare to snatch my things, you are courting death. The demons quickly turned from spats to fights. Fight each other and kill each other. The law roared and exploded, and the demon stronghold was immediately smashed to pieces. Soon some demons were seriously injured and were beaten by their own people. Lin Moyu saw it in his eyes, but he didn't expect the dreamy starry sky to be so effective. If this continues, it won't take long for the demons to kill and injure a large number of people. But Lin Moyu doesn't want this, because this is his military exploits. When the fantasy starry sky unfolded, the encircling army quickly approached, and the legion ruler launched the attack first. The majestic sword energy swept out, instantly killing a large number of demons. The long-range attack of the skeleton god will also completely engulf the evil stronghold. Although their attacks are a little weaker, as long as there are enough scrapes, they can still cause some damage. Maybe it doesn't have much effect on weekdays, but for some half-dead demons, it can play a role in supplementing the knife. The attacks of the legion rulers and skeleton generals were overshadowed by the dreamy starry sky of the starlight galaxy lich. Even some demons have been beheaded and their bodies are broken, but in the eyes of his companions, the other party is still alive and kicking to grab the treasure with him. Seeing this scene, Lin Moyu couldn't help sighing, the power of the fantasy starry sky is too strong, no wonder it can trap the peak of the king of gods. From the beginning to the present, in just ten minutes, nearly one third of the thousand demons have died. But these demons didn't find anything in a daze. It is estimated that they will all die after waiting, and they will not find out. 
In fact, Lin Moyu can kill them as quickly as possible, all he needs is the cooperation of the Starlight Galaxy Lich and the Flame Galaxy Demon. That way, none of the demon's corpses will be left. This is not the result Lin Moyu hoped for. He still needs these corpses, and it is not bad to use them to play corpse explosions. There are four demons of the seventh rank of the King of Gods inside. With their corpses, it is very possible to kill the demons of the eighth rank of the King of Gods. Under the control of Dream Starry Sky, all the demons in the outer layer died in less than half an hour, leaving no one left. On the yellow sand, corpses are everywhere. The blood of the devil dyed the yellow sand strange colors. In the strong wind, the yellow sand kept blowing, and it would not take long for all the traces here to be covered up. The skeletons collected a large number of corpses, as well as all the magic weapons stored in them, not a single one was let go. Lin Moyu is very poor now and needs blood recovery. He looked at the fireball marked number 6 above his head, and stepped forward in the direction it enveloped. Dot. The numbers of the fireballs have been slowly formed over the years, and there was no specific statement before the beginning. At present, the range radiated by fireballs 1 to 4 belongs to the outer region. It is the safest area in the entire lowest desert except for the edge area. The area covered by the three fireballs 5, 6, and 7 is the middle area, and the danger is greatly increased. The leader of the sand tribe didn't go into the deep area, so he didn't know the deep area. But Lin Moyu can guess that the deep area must be more dangerous. And in the middle area, the sand clan and the earth monster joined forces to occupy an area, presumably not because they didn't want to occupy the area alone, but because it was too dangerous. Beside Lin Moyu, a stone demon followed step by step. Even if it curls up, it still has three meters of aggregates. It rolled on the right side of Lin Moyu, blocking the heat from that side. On the left is a legion ruler as high as 10 meters, and the legion ruler also blocked part of the heat. Lin Moyu moved forward in the shadow of the two, feeling very comfortable. Although I'm not afraid of the heat, I don't like the high temperature either. This demon who reached the seventh rank of God King was resurrected by Lin Moyu with, Resurrection of the Dead. From its mouth, I learned some information about the middle area. Although it doesn't know much, it can complement the information of the sand people. It's a pity that he is also ignorant of the deep information. From the information he said, the monsters in the middle area became extremely powerful, completely different from the outer area. If we talk about the outer area, demons of the same realm can easily kill monsters of the same realm, and even after using magic weapons, they can deal with two or three monsters of the same realm at the same time. Then in the middle area, the situation began to change. The strength of monsters has been greatly improved, even if it is one-on-one -on -one with demons of the same realm, it will be very difficult to fight. In the case of a one-on-two situation, they can only escape, and they may not even be able to escape. Even with the magic weapon, it is difficult to gain an advantage. Therefore, in the middle area, demons often go together, except for a few powerful ones, generally they will not act alone. This information is very relevant. The previous Shah people did not say it, and of course it is possible that he did not know it either. And even if there is a key, if you want to enter the middle area from the outer area, you will also encounter attacks when you pass the boundary of the fireball. The key gives eligibility, not giving you unhindered access. After half a day, Lin Moyu began to feel the breath of the middle area. The power of number 2 fireball and number 6 fireball may be intertwined and entangled with each other. Lin Moyu knew he had entered the transition zone between the outer zone and the middle zone. The transition zone is safe, and it is also the place where practitioners rest for the last time. A touch of green appeared in front of my eyes, and an oasis appeared in front of me. There was a touch of dampness in the space, and water elements were flying in the air. The water element contains laws, although it is not strong, but it is enough to resist the fireball in the air, so that it will not be evaporated. Lin Moyu has seen oases when he was outside. He knows that there are oases in the lowest desert, but there are not many oases. It is only when you are in it that you know that these oases will only appear at the junction of the two regions. This can also be regarded as a place for those who want to enter the next area to rest and recover. After thinking about this, Lin Moyu revealed a strange look in his eyes, why is it almost the same as the safe zone of the dungeon backquote? He remembered that when playing dungeons in the past, there was usually a safe zone before entering the next scene, or before fighting the boss. Only after passing the safe zone can the real battle begin. Professionals can recover their strength, rest and improve their condition in the safe zone. 
Now this oasis has more or less a similar function. Lin Mo Yu came to the edge of the oasis, the water quality is clear, exuding a strong power of law. There are fish swimming in the water, but they are not real fish, but fish produced by the laws of the water system. Lin Mo Yu stretched out his hand to grab it, and a stream of clear water automatically flew out and entered the mouth. The water quality is clear and sweet, with strong water elements, driving away fatigue. After drinking the water in the oasis, it seems that the surrounding temperature has dropped a lot. It's not an illusion, but the ubiquitous water law, which helps him block the heat radiated by the fireball. Drinking the water in the oasis can not only restore physical fitness, but also has a certain healing effect. On the edge of the oasis, there is a big rock, like a hill. A pattern is engraved on the boulder. According to the people of the Shah tribe and the demon tribe, this big rock is the exit. If you want to leave the lowest desert, you only need to use your soul power to activate this boulder, and it will be teleported out. There is such a stone in every oasis. It can be seen from this that if you want to go out after entering the lowest desert, you must at least go through the outer layer. And if someone enters the middle area and finds that there is danger, they can also withdraw, retreat to the edge of the oasis, and either rest or leave. From this point of view, the safety of this lowest desert is quite high, much safer than the mysterious manner. Cross the oasis and continue towards the middle area. Along the way, the aura from the outer region gradually weakened, while the aura belonging to the middle region increased rapidly. The temperature has risen again, and it has risen enough to kill ordinary true gods. Lin Mo Yu turned a blind eye to this, and the pure heat would have no effect on him. Soon, the aura belonging to the outer region completely disappeared. Looking back, number two fireball was already faint and inconspicuous in the air. And number six fireball is burning above the head, extremely blazing. He has come to the final gap between the outer layer and the middle layer, and if he takes two steps forward, he will really enter the Chinese area. Lin Mo Yu only stayed for less than a second before stepping into the middle area. It was as if he had passed through an invisible membrane, and the membrane resonated with the breath of the key, allowing Lin Mo Yu to pass through. If there is no key, this membrane cannot be passed through, even if the little god comes. Boom. Without any warning, a fireball fell from the sky and exploded above the head, creating a dense rain of fire, turning the space with a radius of 10,000 meters into a sea of flames. Lin Mo Yu reacted extremely quickly, stepped out with one step, and crossed the distance of 10,000 meters in an instant. A stream of yellow sand rose into the sky in an instant, and quickly condensed into a wall, blocking Lin Mo Yu's exit. Lin Moyu's castration remained unchanged, and he did not retreat to fight back. His whole body suddenly exerted force, like a shell, and directly smashed through the Shashan wall. The sand wall shattered, and what he smashed was not just the sand wall, but also the law. A gust of wind whistled in my ears, and a tornado was born out of thin air. The yellow sand was rolled up and quickly enveloped the surrounding area. Lin Mo Yu lost his vision in an instant, and could see nothing in front of him except the yellow sand that covered the sky and the sun. Then the eyes suddenly brightened, the fireball fell from the sky and landed in the tornado, and the yellow sand tornado turned into a fire dragon circle. Before Lin Mo Yu could react, a large number of vines suddenly sprouted from the ground where he was, and entangled his feet. Plant. Lin Mo Yu's heart trembled slightly, he didn't expect that there were plants under the desert. The fire tornado struck at the same time, without giving him any time to react, the scorching flames and the yellow sand flying rapidly hit him. The flames burned his body, the yellow sand hit his body like bullets, and the feet were bound by plants, which made it impossible for Lin Mo Yu to avoid it. No matter how fast the speed is, at this moment, it is of no avail. Lin Mo Yu calmly endured the attack of the yellow sand flames. Finger lightly. The red light came on, followed by hoarse screams, and the vines wrapped around the feet shrank back like an electric shock. Dot. Grabbing his own vines and retreating, Lin Mo Yu seized the time to regain his freedom. With both feet exerting force, his whole body jumped out like lightning. It crossed hundreds of kilometers in an instant, leaving the flame tornado and sandstorm far behind. Only then did Lin Mo Yu turn around to see what was going on there. In the flame tornado, the sand dunes rolled and protruded, and huge vines drilled out of the sand, flying in the air. It seems to be very angry, don't bark its teeth and claws in the air. Lin Mo Yu smiled, of course he knew why the other party was angry. The soul is attacked, the pain is unbearable, and anyone can be angry. Fusion spell, curse of time. 
In the composition of Lin Moyu's combat power, the curse of time is no longer effective. But it has two advantages. The first advantage, even if you are a high-level god king realm, you will be affected to some extent, not necessarily injured, at least it will hurt. Moreover, it is a pain from the soul level, which is unbearable for ordinary people. So he can interrupt many spells and have a good harassment effect. The second advantage, it does not require locking on target. With Lin Moyu's current strength, the coverage of the time curse exceeds thousands of kilometers, and it is a three-dimensional coverage. Even hiding underground is useless. Curse of Time is a very useful spell when the target cannot be found. In fact, Lin Moyu also has a technique that can quickly find the enemy, and it is also very convenient. That is Bone Armor. Through the linkage of multi-star spells, once someone attacks you, the spells will automatically lock the enemy to counterattack. It's just that the Bone Armor is passive to find enemies, and because of the large difference in strength, the counterattack power of the spell linkage is really not enough to see, Lin Moyu has not used it for a long time. The biggest function of the Bone Armor is actually to use it when confronting enemies in the same realm, especially in group battles. It's just that he has always crushed the enemy by numbers, and rarely encounters the situation of being crushed by others. Boom! There was a roar in the air again, and the sky shook. Lin Moyu found that the dark fireball seemed to be bigger than before. It has indeed grown, to be precise it has swelled. In just a few seconds, it expanded several times. Immediately it exploded with a bang, and the flames fell like meteors, the posture was exactly the same as the flame meteors in the outer area. It's just that the flame meteor is more powerful at this moment, and cultivators below the fifth level of the god king will be very embarrassed in the face of such a situation, and they will be in danger of falling at any time. And the danger comes not only from the flaming meteors in the sky, but also from the yellow sand all over the sky, BGBD, even under the yellow sand. The yellow sand flies and rolls, combining the laws of earth and stone, combining with each other to form countless sharp stone thorns. Every stone thorn is extremely sharp, which makes people daunting. Under the earth, the yellow sand exploded at the same time, and countless strands came whipping like whips. Flames, stone thorns, and vines formed a three-dimensional blow. Even if it is the seventh level of the King of Gods, if it does not have enough adaptability and a powerful enough magic weapon, it will die here. Only this point has clearly divided the middle area and the outer area. Except for the leader level monsters in the outer area, as long as they don't kill themselves, there is not much danger. Even boss level monsters have high defense and low attack, so they can save their lives if they want to escape. But when it comes to the middle level area, the situation changes completely. The difficulty is greatly increased, and you will lose your life at any time. Lin Moyu analyzed all kinds, turning a blind eye to the oncoming danger. He has too many ways to avoid these crises, for example, he can burst out with enough speed to avoid these attacks directly. But Lin Moyu chose to use the most simple and crude method. The skeleton throne, which was also burning with raging flames, suddenly appeared in midair. The skeleton king got up, and the red cloak fluttered behind him. With a terrifying red light in the skeleton king's eyes, he locked onto the vines under the ground and swung his sword. The sword of Zhanshan exploded directly on the vines, and countless vines were cut off. There was another hoarse scream. Zhanshan's sword not only cut off the vines, but also cut Kuo's body. He didn't die. Lin Moyu has connected to the skeleton king's vision of the undead, and saw that the fire of the soul under the yellow sand is still beating. Under the skeleton king's god-slaying sword, the fire of the soul was obviously much weaker, but it did not die. The vitality of plant monsters is very bat-like. At this time, the flame meteor and the stone thorn have arrived. Lin Moyu ignored the stone thorn and let it hit him. Stone thorns carry powerful earth and stone laws, which are enough to cause damage to the seventh level god king. The damage was transferred to the undead. In the Magic Star, the ruler of the Million Legions treated the undead at the same time. The healing effect is superimposed almost infinitely, just like cheating, the undead will be healed immediately after receiving some damage. Up to now, the seventh level attack of the King of Gods has been unable to really hurt Lin Moyu. The Skeleton King quickly swung the huge bone sword, which was airtight and blocked all the flame meteors from the outside. Lin Moyu's approach was simple and brutal, and he blocked the danger here with just one technique. He walked forward at a leisurely pace. The stone thorns kept coming, and the flaming meteors in the sky kept coming. Only the vine, no longer harassing, it was scared by the skeleton king's sword. 
if it was someone else, they would definitely use the power of magic weapons to cross this area at the fastest speed. Where would it be like Lin Moyu's side, walking so slowly? The skeleton king followed beside him, and the long sword had danced into an airtight cover. Not only blocked all the flame meteors, but also blocked some stone thorns. From the message sent back by Skeleton King, Lin Mo Yu can feel the power of the flame meteor. Coupled with the stone thorn attack I have suffered, I can probably analyze the strength of the middle area. After he walked tens of thousands of kilometers, the rain of fire falling from the sky stopped without warning. The stone thorns dissipated at the same time, turning into wind and sand and disappearing. He walked out of this area with a diameter of tens of thousands of kilometers and passed the entry test of the Chinese area. Lin Mo Yu looked at the number. Six fireball in the sky and the calm yellow sand behind him, thinking deeply. If you can't even pass this area, you are not qualified to operate in the middle area. This is a threshold, like a dungeon in the small world, which will require the level of the entrant. The level is too low. Entering the dungeon is courting death. It's better not to go. It's the same principle here, but one is more direct and the other is more subtle. Lin Mo Yu thought, and felt that what he thought was probably right. His eyes slowly retracted, and he turned to look in another direction. A hundred kilometers away, the yellow sand rolled and flew straight into the sky, and two huge stone balls were rolling towards the yellow sand at high speed. With a majestic momentum, the stone ball stirred up a large area of yellow sand, like a sandstorm, covering the sky and blocking out the sun. Stone Demon what Lin Mo Yu saw at a glance were two stone demons, and immediately he understood why the other party came. It is estimated that I saw the flame meteor, so I came to have a look. If it is the same race, I will welcome it, and if it is a foreign race, I will kill it. The stone demon's head is not complicated, probably because of this. Lin Mo Yu chuckled, I'm here to give away the head so soon, just in time to ask something. The skeleton king came out in response, raising his sword and dropping it technique, slay god. The sword light exploded, and the bodies of the two rolling stone demons were shattered, turning into large pieces of rubble and falling everywhere. The body of the stone demon is composed of stones, the higher the realm, the thicker the stones. The stone is both the body and the armor, and the defensive power of the stone demon is second to none among the demons. The skeleton king's sword wounded two stone demons, but could not kill them. The two stone demons are both god kings of the seventh rank, not much weaker than the skeleton king. The shattered stones rolled back, and the law became a strand, pulling the stones back to form the body again. It's just behind him that the body lacks. Slashing the gods with a sword is not without effect. The two stone demons stared at Lin Mo Yu vigilantly, with a look of shock at the same time. Here they actually met the human race. As far as they know, the human race hasn't set foot here for thousands of years, why is it here again now? And what makes them most incomprehensible is that this little human race guy in front of him is just a true god. The stone demon adhered to the habit of not thinking about it until he understood it, and a fierce light began to appear in his small eyes covered by the boulder. Boy of the human race, go to hell. There is no need to talk nonsense, the stone demon will do it directly. A piece of gravel appeared beside Lin Mo Yu, and a liquid could be faintly seen flowing in this piece of gravel, which was a piece of flesh and blood belonging to a stone demon. In the outer area, there are a total of four stone demons who have reached the seventh level of God King. After being killed by Lin Mo Yu, one of the extravagant ones was used as a resurrection, but unfortunately, not much useful information was obtained. The remaining three statues were used as materials for the body to burst, and became powerful weapons in Lin Mo Yu's hands. The soul was instantly locked, Lin Mo Yu's hand shimmered, and the stone demon's gravel shattered on the spot. Della spell, corpse explosion. The explosion sounded almost simultaneously, and the bodies of the two stone demons who had just rushed over were blown to pieces on the spot. The corpse of the seventh rank god king is very likely to be blown to death by the eighth rank god king. Even if it is now divided into two, it will not be a problem at all to kill two stone demons of the seventh rank of the god king at the same time. The stone demon's body was torn apart again, turning into pieces of rubble scattered all over the ground. This time even the law was blown to pieces, the soul perished, and could never be restored again. The defensive strength they are proud of is useless in the face of attacks that far exceed their endurance. With a casual move, a piece of gravel flew towards Lin Mo Yu and was picked up by Lin Mo Yu. One of the corpses of the stone demon in this piece of gravel was used, so it was natural to add another. 
As for the other corpse, it was shrouded in undead flames at this moment. Lin Mo Yu used, Resurrection of the Dead, popping out a ball of undead flames, turning another golem into Chia Shengnan. Soon, this stone demon of the seventh rank of God King prostrated respectfully in front of Lin Mo Yu, his huge body was like a hill. Lin Mo Yu asked casually, Do you know the conditions for the emergence of boss level monsters in the middle area? I know. The stone demon gave a hoarse voice, and gave an affirmative answer. Lin Mo Yu was a little happy in his heart, and he didn't expect to ask out all of a sudden. He didn't believe there was any coincidence. Obviously, this matter was not a secret. Anyone who entered this area should know about it. After waiting for a few seconds, the stone demon still knelt without any movement. Lin Mo Yu just slapped his head, he realized that he made a mistake. The stone demon's head is too simple, he asked himself if he knew the conditions for the appearance of a leader level monster, and the stone demon answered honestly. But he didn't ask what the specific conditions were. With the simple head of the stone demon, he would not continue to answer at all. It's really stupid. He slandered, not knowing whether to scold the stone demon or himself, and then asked, tell me the specific conditions. The resurrected stone demon immediately replied, collect enough crystal nuclei, combine them together, as long as there are enough, you can summon boss level monsters. Lin Mo Yu continued to ask, how many do you want? The stone demon replied in a muffled voice, I don't know. Um, Lin Mo Yu believes that the stone demon after becoming a resurrected person will not hide anything. Since he said he didn't know, he must not know. Is there anything else in it? Lin Mo Yu thought, at this moment he deeply felt that it was really interesting to talk to smart people. Of course, talking to normal people is fine too. But talking to such a stupid creature is a bit uncomfortable. Lin Mo Yu pondered for a few seconds, he didn't stop asking questions, but changed the way of asking, is the number of crystal cores needed to summon a leader level monster not fixed? The stone demon said in a low voice, if it's a seventh order crystal nucleus, then you need a little more. If it's an eighth order crystal nucleus, you can use a little less. Lin Mo Yu finally understood, it wasn't that the stone demon didn't answer clearly, but that he didn't ask clearly enough. Summoning boss level monsters in the middle area requires enough crystal nuclei. This kind of sufficiency does not refer to the number of crystal nuclei, but the energy contained in the crystal nuclei. As long as the energy reaches the standard, the leader level monster can be summoned. Ask for flowers. In the middle area, there are two kinds of monsters, one is the 7th level god king, and the other is the 8th level god king. The fallen crystal nuclei are also divided into two levels. The energy contained in the 7th level crystal nucleus of the god king is naturally very different from the 8th level crystal nucleus of the god king. In the case that energy needs to be fixed, if all the 8th level crystal nuclei of the king of gods are used, the number of testes will naturally be much less. But as long as you are not an idiot, you will know that the difficulty of hunting the 8th level monsters of the god king is much higher than hunting the 7th level monsters of the god king. In terms of cost performance, it is better to kill more monsters of the 7th rank of the king of gods. Lin Mo Yu took out all the crystal nuclei he currently has, there are thousands of nuclei. Lots of quantity, just not enough quality. It ranges from the 4th rank of god king to the 6th rank of god king. These crystal nuclei are collected from the demon stronghold in the outer area. During the questioning of the stone demon, Lin Mo Yu discovered some differences between the outer layer and the middle layer. The crystal nuclei obtained by hunting in the outer area can be used by oneself, and do not need to be handed in. And half of the crystal nuclei obtained from hunting in the middle area must be handed over. If you get two, you need to hand in one. This one is used to summon boss level monsters. With this discovery, Lin Mo Yu came up with an idea. He can completely do the same, robbing the demon strongholds in the middle area, and taking their crystal nuclei as his own. In that way, even if the crystal nucleus is not enough, it should be too far away. At least you can save yourself a lot of time. Lin Mo Yu continued to ask, when was the last time a leader level monster was summoned? Stone Demon replied honestly, 59 years ago. Lin Mo Yu muttered to himself, 59 years have passed, it seems that there should be a lot of crystal nuclei accumulated in the stone demon stronghold. It also proves that every time a boss monster is summoned, the number of crystal nuclei required is astonishing. Looking at the stone demon who was still kneeling on the ground, he continued to ask, how many keys can be dropped every time the boss monster appears? Two or three. Hearing the answer, Lin Mo Yu was slightly surprised. 
This number is a bit small, that is to say, every time they appear, at most two or three people can be qualified to enter the deep area. Of course, the ninth rank of God King is not so easy to achieve. But there are so many demons, and no matter how few God Kings are in the ninth rank, it's still a little bit. Lin Moyu realized another problem, in the middle area, there are a few demons of the ninth rank of God King.